I'm Vishanti. Welcome to 6th of October Scotty Pressing. How do we transfer energy to somebody? Now, we are not talking about electrical energy, we are talking about spiritual energy. How do you transfer love to someone? How do you transfer happiness, joy, contentment, peace to somebody? And God says in very simple words, your eyes are the window to the soul. That means what is going on within you, how pure you are can be seen through your eyes. So may you be a great donor and an image that is blessed, who gives and receives power with your trishti. As you progress in the future, when there won't be time or circumstances to serve with words, just like we are doing right now, every Sunday we are trying to do programs, we are trying to inculcate certain different ideas and then showcase them to you and share with you. So God is saying that won't be possible during the end days when the situations all around in terms of five elements in terms of religious conflicts in terms of intercontinental conflicts which is known as third world war and diseases and many more negative things which will be happening around us and that time nobody will have time to listen to us you will then only be able to give the experience of the powers of peace love happiness and bliss with the drishti that means Whatsoever we have stored over here as a soul, that's what we'll be able to give out to other souls. That of a great donor and an image who is blessed. When you go in front of the non-living idols, right? When people who are into devotion, they go to the temples and they stand in front of the idols and they are praying that may I have a look at your your eyes, may I have a look, oh deity, may I have a look at your mouth, which is... the say that the mouth the eyes the hands are as pure as a lotus and that's why they call it as hast kamal nan kamal muk kamal that means they're comparing the eyes with coolness like a lotus the mouth speaking pure things the hand always giving out blessings like this so these are all symbols of purity so god says that when you go in front of the non-living idols you receive vibrations from their faces and you feel divinity from their eyes. You see, none of the idols which are made in the temples have got any angry face or have got any jealous face or greedy face or a greedy eyes. No, they are completely divine and their vibrations are completely peaceful. It is because you did this service in the living form that the non-living images have been made. So the present physical form which we are doing service in, this is what helps us to become like them, divine beings. So practice giving and receiving power with the Trishti and you will become a great donor and an image that is blessed. So this practice has to be done through our thoughts, through our vibrations and that's what we learn in Brahma Kumaris. And how do we receive that power is through Murlis, the daily spiritual teaching. But before we go to the Murlis, there's one more step seven day course one hour a day do go over to brahma kumai center and do this before it's too late i'm shanti with this